Hey, it's Victoria Gibson, and I wanted to run you through the new Facebook format pretty much as I go through it. Um, I've already seen some pretty big changes that might influence how you show up in the feed, how your brand shows up, how you connect with others, and how your ads look now too. Now, I don't know if you have this new feature. Um, basically, it was just a little pop-up at the top of my profile that, asked, uh, that said I was eligible for a new Facebook the to try the new facebook.com did i want to i said yes i selected the dark layout so you can still have white or dark layout i chose the dark just to give it a go so it does look quite different right i'm just on my uh the my client group that i have so i'll go on to the home page so you can see what that could look like so um, basically what I saw is, um, yes, we've been seeing stories for a while, but obviously they're front and center up here. You can post here as per usual. None of that has changed. What has changed here is this um, ads uh, layout here. This looks quite different um, in that it's probably more because it's it's black in the background and these are kind of graphic -y images. I, would, I wish that it would... Um, change so I could see some more and see what that was going to look like. Um, okay, I won't hide the ads because I think that gives negative feedback to people. Scrolling through the feed is all kind of normal. <clears throat> That's fine. If I go to my business page over here, um, I can manage my page as per usual, see the insights in there. That's where it's going to go first. Um, now, Ad Center, let's have a look and see what's going on in here. Um, advertising summary, uh, I've got a lot of ad accounts I manage, so they'll be different for different people. Um, oh, no, maybe that's for this page, but it's weird. It's got pounds in there, so that's a little bit weird. Um, okay, so that's just, yeah, recent ads. You can create your ad from in there. I'm going to go through there and see if there's anything different in, ah, okay, that's looking a little bit different. Maybe that's because I'm going through from my page. So it's probably more about trying to get people from their page through and I don't normally go through there. But let's have a look um, and see what that looks like. So say I want to get more website visitors. What's it going to tell me here? Okay. Um, all right, this is just the simple sort of connect the dots for people who are coming through from the page to try and show them and make it easier. Um, I think you can still go through as per usual to your ad account. So you shouldn't have to use that. Um, that's really about managing your page. So if we go to home, let's scroll through the top bits and see what we can see that are different, um, shortcut, etc. Newsfeed, contacts for Messenger. I'm wondering where Messenger is going to pop up. It can still pop up here, so that's all good. Um, then I've got Facebook Watch, so I can just make my um, feed all the videos that uh, Facebook suggests for me. Little like YouTube there, right? You can see I don't watch uh, Donald Trump videos normally, but that's now this. Okay, they're thinking I might be interested in some of these. Oh, yeah, I've watched that guy before. He's pretty funny. Um, I love it uh, and yeah, so that's fine. So then I can do my watch and then I can do marketplace. Look, I can't really imagine I'm going to be going crazy on the, mar I don't really like Facebook marketplace at all. Anyway, then I'm going to look at my groups. That's cool to be able to see your groups. Another reason why we should be looking at, at doing groups, um, and then they're going to have suggested groups. This is what I love about Facebook groups is that there is just that um, algorithm suggestion factor that you're going to get a lot more distribution for free on Facebook because they want to cultivate groups. They're obviously on their agenda. They're on the top. You know, these are their channels, right? They want to push through on video. They want to push through on marketplace and they want to push through on groups. Let's see if there's anything else. What's the other? Oh, gaming. Okay, that must be the other area they're pushing into. I am not touching any of those games because you'll get retargeted with 100,000 spammy ads and that will be revolting. So I would lose the gaming, but obviously that's where they know they're getting revenue, advertisers, engagement and usage. So let's have a look and see if there's anything else. We've got all the terms, ads. So when I want to set up my ads, 
this is what I wanted to check. Normally I go up here. So what's that doing? That's just going to go into my profile, which is fine. Is it still here to do ads? So I can switch just to show you what light mode looks like. That's nice and bright. Actually, I think I prefer light mode. I'm going to give a dark a little bit of a uh, try anyway. Okay, so my ads aren't there. What's this? This is just notifications, messenger, create, add. So I'll have to go push, create, add. They're always changing things, aren't they? So then I'll go to my ads manager creation. That doesn't look like the ads manager or business manager has changed. No, that's all pretty much the same. So that's all good. Okay. So there's a little tour for you. Um, the main things that I could really see were the ads on desktop. It'll be interesting to see what this looks like on mobile. Um, but thought I'd give you a bit of a tour. Hope you enjoyed it. Okay. Chat soon.